Just because Obama is out of the White House, it doesn't mean he's finished parading around like he's the freaking king of planet Earth. Over the week, the former narcissist in chief and Michelle traveled for their lavish vacation in Italy, where they had to make sure that the world knew they were arriving. The royal couple conspicuously arrived in the central Italian region on Friday, where their private jet was escorted by an alarming six fighter jets, complete with a 13 car motorcade, that we are paying for, as they headed to a $15,000 a night private villa. But unfortunately for Obama and his American hating wife, they just had their entire opulent vacation completely wrecked, after receiving devastating news that even their endless stacks of money will be helpless to shield them from. Throughout his two terms in office, Obama and Michelle lived high on the hog thanks to the American taxpayers, as they jet set around on our dime with their luxurious excursions whenever their black little hearts had half an inkling. Obama exploited his presidential position by utilizing Air Force One as his personal taxi service to fly all over the world, while racking up a colossal amount of money to the tune of almost $1 billion that the American taxpayers had to foot the bill for. But now that Obama and his snotty wife are out of office, their narcissism and contempt for the American people are now coming back to bite them in the ass in a massive way. The Judicial Watch Group just announced their plans to sue the U.S. Division of Homeland Security, after the government agency flat out refused to react to the FOIA requests they made on March 24, 2017, where the watchdog group asked for all Secret Service records relating to Barack Obama's post-administration trips that he continues to take on our dime. From Judicial Watch, Judicial Watch announced that it obtained records from the Secret Service and the Air Force in response to Freedom of Information Act, FOIA. Requests that show Obama family travel cost taxpayers a grand total of $99,714,527.82. The new Obama White House era travel records show the March 2014 trip to Key Largo during spring break, where the first family stayed at the exclusive Ocean Reef Club, cost the Secret Service $247,827.50. $182,120.33 for hotels and $65,707.17 in travel expenses. The total cost of that trip with previously released $885,683 in flight costs from the Air Force is $1,133,510.50. Other documents show that Michelle Obama's February 2015 Aspen vacation cost the Secret Service a total of $64,807.41, $47,109.28 for hotels, $3,559.43 in rental cars and $14,138.70 in other travel expenses. The total cost of the trip with $57,068.80 in flight costs from previously released Air Force records is $121,876.21. Judicial Watch released documents from the Air Force concerning the 2016-2017 Obama family Christmas trip to Honolulu showing 17.9 hours flying at $142,380 per hour bringing the total flight cost to $2,548,602. Yes, you read that correctly. The Obamas leached a whopping $1 billion freaking dollars from Americans for all their lavish vacations. But Judicial Watch isn't quite done socking it to Barack and Michelle. They also announced this week that they have filed a Freedom of Information Act, FOIA. Lawsuit against the U.S. Department of Homeland Security for Secret Service records associated with President Obama's movements, schedule, and activities since his departure from the White House. The lawsuit was filed in the U.S. District Court for the District of Columbia, Judicial Watch the U.S. Department of Homeland Security, No. 1, 17 CV00928, Conservative Fighters Reported. Here's the information that Judicial Watch is seeking from the FOIA request that the Secret Service still refuses to hand over, as reported by conservative fighters. All records of former President Barack Obama's movements, schedule, activities, and slash or meeting for January 21, 2017 through March 21, 2017. Such records include, but are not limited to, U.S. Secret Service schedules and activity reports. Although Obama is no longer in office, he continues to receive Secret Service protection at taxpayer expense. In January, 
the Obama family traveled to Palm Springs, California. The former president also spent a few weeks in French Polynesia. It looks like Obama's dirty deeds are finally coming to light, thanks to the determination of this watchdog group who has made it their mission to find the truth no matter how many of Obama's little minions stand in the way. Obama is such a massive disgrace to this nation. Not only did he commit treason throughout his time in office, but he continually showed how much contempt he held for Americans as he and his disgusting family jet set around on our dime, while at the same time lecturing Americans, who he views as mere peasants, about how they need to make sacrifices in life. Please do not forget to subscribe and like and comment because we want to hear your voice and thank you for watching.